Hi, so in this video we're going to try to get ourselves and build up our Hartley oscillator that uh, will generate a signal that is slow enough in frequency that we can actually measure with an Arduino. So a Hartley oscillator circuit consists of an LC tank network and the difference between it and say a Colquitt's oscillator is that the, the uh, is usually two inductors with a tap in between them rather than uh, two capacitors with a tank between them. So that's the main difference. And then the other part of the circuit is really just a amplifier circuit. In this case I've got a common emitter amplifier made with a 2N222 transistor. So if we have a look at it on the breadboard here, what I've got is the, the tank circuit. So here's my two inductors and uh, capacitor making the tank circuit. And we can see here there's a little sender tap going off to ground that uh, makes the tank. Then over here we've got two just coupling capacitors that go to the transistor amplifier power coming across and then over here we've got our transistor amplifier so biasing resistors here and then two 220 ohm resistors here that are going from the emitter. Then on the collector side I've got this trimmer pot and why I use this is because what I find with most of these oscillators is it's easier to just kind of throw something together and then tweak the one of the values until we can get the thing to oscillate at all or at least with a good waveform. And that's what I'm going to do here. Okay, so let's fire it up and see if we can get it to oscillate. I'm going to get my Excel connection going here to my Arduino. Start reading the data. And then we can do some tweaking of this trimmer and see if we can get Oh, look at that. Okay, so we've got our thing oscillating and we can probably vary the size of this waveform a bit by messing with the with messing with the trimmer there. And that's kind of it. Now if I take this too far, the wave may stop or it may um, have an ugly shape. Looks like it's just going to have a bit of an ugly shape, but it works. Um, and that's the Hartley oscillator where you can measure it with an Arduino. So um, hope you enjoyed the video. Thanks very much for watching.